You are watching the Patriot League on ESPN. It is a battle between two Boston rivals, the Harvard Crimson and the 18th ranked Boston University Terriers from Nickerson Field for the eighth time in series history. The two teams these two have matched up. And there's a goal down the doorstep on the right side for Lay. Bork to his right, Bork downhill low and he scores to make it two nothing Terriers. Boy, open yep. in transition, top shelf. Tremendous find and an unselfish pass by Miles Botkus. 33 in white. Nice flip up top, bounce shot. Trickles in. Although Harvard's no stranger to seeing high flying offenses playing in the conference, they do. Travellini wants the top shelf. Second goal of the season for the sophomore. Like offensive midfielders. Doorstep, bounce, yes. Harvard back within two. An individual effort of. And there's that goal from the goalie. Barnard did it again. He keeps looking full field. It's coming in and it looks like it's gonna go in. Who's the one that should get over there? But they gave it right back. BU off the face off. NCAA tournament, the loss to Rutgers. Loose ball, flipped in! Oh, Harvard's gotten two. Bots, offense in motion. That one's low and in. Finally, Dialto is in on the action. For four goals this season. Bounce shot, low, and that's another one. Needering house. That would be a highly specific goal. <laughs> yeah. There's a bounce that drops in. And an Was eighth it a new goal. Person? It is not. It's oh. the second goal for Timmy Lay. Potentially get into a tough spot. There's no one back home. That ball's ripped high and in. And Harvard's spinning around now from X. Looking for help. Couldn't find a cutter. Takes it himself. And that's a goal for the Terriers. Exactly what they needed. It Neither of these two teams would mind being there. That's right. BU making its first NCAA appearance last year, and Harvard is back within two goals of that Terriers jersey team right. in the NCAA tournament. It's a recipe for disaster. That's a good response, though. Up top hat trick. Timmy Lay has three, and a discount double check to go with it. Yes. Or look out in front. Lay, hey. give him four. Feed the beast. 22 goals this season for one of the all-time greats in Boston. Not a super high level of lacrosse in high school. Play a lot and get exposed to a lot, like Nick Loring. This is Travellini. He has a goal today. His second of the year. Trying to bull dodge Ooh. his way. He has his second of the night. Prior to it actually happening. Out in front. You can't much anticipate anything there. <laughs> You just have to watch Timmy Lay score his fifth goal of the night. Up there. Dan DeGoler. And there's a Harvard goal to claw back into things. Have pieces in place. Trying to roll around the Ooh. side of the cage. Oh boy. Yep. Yeah. First over Harvard since 2017. Doorstep. That's low. It's in. And the game's not yet sealed because Harvard's back within two. And with every piece of this frenetic pace and frenetic situation, time just ticks away. And that ball is scooted all the way downfield and into the back of the net. That is the second full field goal of the day, one from each side. Spinning in traffic, loose ball picked oh. up, and a save! Garber, door closed. Cleared downfield just to get it out of harm's way. Time running away all while it happens. BU on the doorstep for the finisher. Tommy Bork's second. Seconds left. That ball sails over his head. It is a 15-11 final for BU, and they storm the field like they're going to Memorial Day.